Hello, I'm Philip Brunel, Artistic Director and Founder of Vocal Essence and Organist Choir Master at Plymouth Congregational Church in Minneapolis. Today, we're going to talk about the composer Edvard Grieg, certainly Norway's most famous composer. Born in 1843, died in 1907, both a composer and a pianist, lived most of his life in Bergen, Norway. He was really the one who brought Norwegian folk music into the realization that there was music to be had arranged from that music. He started playing the piano when he was six. In 1868, he wrote his famous piano concerto that we know. Uh, in 1876, he composed the music for Peer Gint, incidental music that Ibsen had requested from him. And in fact, in 2005, for Vocal Essence, the Norwegian National Opera came, uh, the soloists came here and joined the chorus of Vocal Essence, the orchestra, and we performed the music from it was a great, wonderful experience for all of us. At the end of his life, Grieg, the last choral piece he wrote was a set of four psalms. And in the edition that was published, Percy Granger, who edited it, said about these psalms, the last music that flowed from Grieg's pen outpourings of that rapt devotional mood that he had done in earlier works. The music is remarkable for the masterly manner in which highly original and daring complexities of chromatic and enharmonic polyphonic harmony are couched in a perfectly vocal and natural singable style. I'm going to play for you the first of the Psalms a cappella piece called How Fair Is Thy Face. It's for baritone solo and a cappella chorus. I know this one because we performed it one year, uh, about 10 years ago, when the Swedish baritone Håkan Hagegård was here and sang them with the ensemble singers. So here is How Fair Is Thy Face, and you'll love this very minor brooding thing which finally at the end, when he says in the text, all that I have is thine, becomes major.
Music of Edvard Grieg, How Fair Is Thy Face. Grieg died in 1907. Uh, he was beloved. I mean, Norway just believed this man was the soul of what Norwegian music could be. At his funeral, the casket went along the street. 40,000 people stood along the street in Bergen to pay homage to this man. In addition to the beautiful music that he wrote for orchestra and chorus, he also did a whole bunch of songs. And among the songs was a song called Voren, which means spring. And I thought that's another whole side of Grieg, and it would be wonderful to hear one of those. So I think what I'm going to do is take my coat off because it's springtime. And I'm delighted that Leave Redpath, a wonderful soprano who sang with us at Vocal Essence a year ago when we did Candide and she was Conagonda. So here is Leave Redpath joining me to sing Voren. Thank you. 